Okay, so now you understand the importance of taking the action and how the small actions or the small opportunities that present themselves perhaps will have a fundamental effect on your own performance, growth and development. It's about taking action in that present moment. Now I've worked with some fantastic celebrities, Olympic athletes, entrepreneurial business owners and multi-million pound or billion pound corporations over the last 15 years. And within that, there is one thing that I meet on a regular basis, and that is resistance. Now, I'm bringing this up in the early stages of this series for one very simple reason. The more that you resist self, resist taking the action in that present moment, the more that you're missing out on the opportunities that are gonna fundamentally improve your performance, health and happiness. Now, I say this right now because you're gonna be shown once you've installed or one, as part of changing your mindset, opportunities that are gonna be presented to you on a daily basis. Now, I can only give you a certain amount of information. It's up to you to be taking the action needed in order for accept and welcome that into your life. What I'm gonna ask you to do is to release any fear, any concern that you've had over the last 20, 30 years of your life about who you're gonna be. So I'm gonna ask you, invite you right now to release that who you are to be thought process and write down who you are. Now, this is something that I ask clients to do on a very, very early stage in the first or second stages of their consultation process to answer who they are. Now, we, as part of that questioning process, generally people will write down all of the external aspects. I'm a father, I'm a mother, um, I'm a business owner, I am a homeowner, I'm this, all of the external. What I'm gonna invite you to do now is write down all of the internal, who you are inside. It's a process that probably you've not experienced or is very unlikely you've experienced in the past. There's gonna be a lot of lining out, there's gonna be a lot of alterations to this statement, but I want you to do it in less than 500 words. Write down less than 500 words who you are. Now, it doesn't matter whether you're a multi-million pound business owner, whether you have a Ferrari in your garage, whether you're an Olympic athlete, or whether you're a amateur track athlete. What I'm gonna invite you to do is exactly the same process. I have no judgment over who you are, but what I want you to do is to complete this exercise being 100% truthful with the answers that you're gonna give. So go ahead right now, pause this video, before moving on to the next in the series, or if you're receiving this as part of the follow-up series, what I want you to do is to avoid the temptation to skip to the next video until you have really written down five less than 500 words who you are without mentioning any external things. Removing all the materialistic, I wanna know who you are internally. Now, to push this onto the next level, what I'm gonna invite you to do is to release that. Once you've written that down, I'm gonna ask you to release it and send it to me at the email address included in the details below. I want you to send to me the statement that you've written about who you are. Now, it doesn't matter whether you receive a reply or not. I do read all of my emails personally. They go through to the team and then I review them and read them. But the act in release actually will shift your mind and your thought process to another level. So what I'm gonna invite you to do, less than 500 words, who you are, without mentioning any of the materialistic possessions or the things that you have on the outside, those statements of the outside. And then once you've completed that and revised it before moving on to the next video, I want you to send it to me.